Criminal activity around two abandoned buildings just off I-90 in North Rapid City has some residents concerned about the future of the area. Our Juliana Alford has more. Urban blight can be described as the building behind me. Abandoned, vacant, and vandalized. It is also defined as a deterioration of a building or home and includes vacant lots with weeds and trash. On the Nextdoor app, some people have raised concern over these empty buildings in North Rapid. One user saying, quote, These properties are bringing more crime than graffiti. They're being used as trap houses and attracting more drug users and criminal behavior in our community. When speaking to the city officials about these properties, they say the first step to fix or demolish these buildings is getting a complaint about the property. When the complaint comes in, if uh, we establish a code case first, and with that code case, then it's on record that we've re received the complaint, uh, and then at that point, then we can uh, schedule for inspections to occur on site. Depending on the complaint, the property owner will have a certain amount of time to fix the problem. Once that timeline expires, we'll reinspect the site, um, and from there, if the property owner is got everything taken care of, then the case is closed. Um, if it's not taken care of, then um, the city will go in um, and remove that stuff and, and actually send that bill to the property owner. As far as the future of these buildings, there is currently no plan to demolish the structures. Ideally, I would love to go in and kind of redevelop the property, but it's owned by somebody. And as long as they're following all the laws and the community code enforcement, we're a little limited in the options of what we can do as a city. Reporting in Rapid City, I'm Juliana Alford.